We are in Agios Nikolaos and today it is the 20th of April 2023. It was a nice sunny shiny day and I don't know from nowhere the clouds appeared and kind of ruined the landscape. I guess no, maybe some people needed some shadow. <laughs> yeah, so we will be taking a walk. Uh, as far as, as I can see, Ayos Nikolaos is uh, pretty much uh, open and functioning and full of tourists. And I don't know why there is, what is the reason, like it seemed to me more alive, it smells more like food and I kind of can hear the buzz uh, of people in Ayos Nikolaos. Maybe possibly it is because the way the architecture of the town is, everything is around everything it's nothing it's not like uh, like uh, seafront side spread it places everything is all together it gives you the feeling of like being a little bit busier and opener yeah possibly that so yeah let's uh, walk around and see and uh, explore i just nicolaus <laughs> yeah We are just in front of the lake of Ayos Nikolaos and uh, this is uh, very known, you have seen lots of pictures and this place, when I came last time it was, I guess not open but now it is open and they have lots of people uh, drinking coffee and maybe ordering something else, a snack I guess it is uh, a coffee bar, I'm not sure if it's a taverna or if it's a coffee bar, I'm not sure at all Yeah. Maybe sometime I can try. <laughs> I will have to stay away from places where they play music because I can get a copyright claim. But if I, will, if I would replace that, then it's going to sound fake and it's not going to sound original. It, that's a lot of work so that's why I kind of whenever I hear music I begin to blah 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 or I run away yeah so here it, it this is kind of like a square area and there is like oh I don't know what it is but you can see the flags in front of the flags this white color uh, taverna restaurant is uh, 
I guess a good one. I have eaten here before, once or twice, uh, and whenever I am passing by, I'm kind of noticing like they have customers. Whenever here uh, you have like local customers sitting in your taverna and restaurant, it means like you have uh, quality and you also are fair with the prices. So this place is called uh, uh, Car Carnagio restaurant, Carnagio. I hope I'm not butchering the name. It's called Carnegie Restaurant. So yeah, I I can you can you can try something from here as well. And next to it we have a small mini market where uh, I can buy a bottle of water. <laughs> Red Bull is not allowed anymore, I guess. <laughs>
As far as we can see, Ayus Nikolaos seems pretty busy. Yeah, I guess the season has already begun here. And which is a good thing. It's gonna benefit the local economy, some people, those who are tired of sitting at home in the winter, they are back again seeing new faces. Yeah, and the circle of life continues. For those of you who is uh, exploring Ayos Nikolaos for the first time, this is the main square of Ayos Nikolaos and we have some beautiful uh, coffee shops and events around the square and the square itself is really beautiful and green with the orange trees. And uh, one another thing, this is like less touristy uh, area. Oh, well, of course, you will get to see tourists here and there uh, every now and then, but most of the time it is uh, like uh, an area where the locals hang out and the shops in the square will be open winter, summer, no matter. Yeah, because they are here to provide uh, services to the locals. And here we have a very beautiful ice cream shop as well. Uh, if we would go down here, we are going to get to the port of Ayos Nikolaos where they park all the sailing boats and everything and also there is a beach and next to the beach in the seafront side there are some taverns and restaurants okay but uh, we are gonna go and turn around Ayos Nikolaos this is an uh, interesting path that you can walk as well if you are staying in Ayos Nikolaos and right now I'm standing right in front of this uh, big church which is uh, Nick, uh, which is just in front of the square and uh, also the Taverna Rosa is here. I guess they are open, they are functioning, their tables and chairs are out, but uh, their shop is closed. Well, this is very uh, pretty uh, obvious that now it is too early for them to be open. This is... Yeah. It is from 2018, but it seems I have eaten here only once and only in that time, on that one time, I ate uh, kiliftiko. Kiliftiko is a food, uh, it is uh, the lamb and also it has potatoes and it's cooked in a very traditional uh, way. I don't know if kiliftiko exists in the other parts of Greece or not, but it sounds to me really Cretan. So the food of the shepherds uh, I ate here and it was very affordable and it was also mind-blowingly tasty so if you were uh, looking for a good place and, uh, and also high quality not pricey place to eat I uh, confidently can uh, recommend this area and uh, on the weekends I guess they also have uh, live music as well I'm not saying all of this because I have no no business. I have never been sponsored. I never I have never done sponsorship videos. I just 
I am doing this uh, because I kind of care about uh, what's the truth and what's the the what I what is my experience. I'm sharing my personal experience. Maybe you will find you will not find it. You somebody else will not find it uh, the way I have experienced this place. But I'm sharing my personal experience, and if somebody can benefit from that, then it's a win-win. <laughs> yeah. This one here, uh, which you saw right away, this is also winter, summer open. Most of the time, uh, locals are uh, drinking coffee and hanging out in this area. Ah, that's a good touch. I don't know if it is by the municipality or if it is uh, the flavor of this uh, shop owner, but it's nice for some people. Yeah, we are going downhill and if somebody is coming uphill, it's good to have like a seat to sit. <laughs> yeah. There is an idea automatically developing inside my head thinking of like uh, how much I can help uh, with my videos but videos are always not enough because it's kind of entertainment sellers just hanging out and traveling exploring this and that well I cannot go to like uh, uh, details and in uh, particular things that I want to explain to you and I want you I want to connect you with the really quality um, uh, things places products uh, everything like whatever it is it's decent I really cannot uh, juice it in 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 a video so I have been thinking about this idea to 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 launch a website where I can uh, uh, categorize the website uh, to the like uh, uh, gods and to like uh, herbs of Kriti and to some other products and also the navigation the ways with pictures 360 pictures with video clips also dedicate the videos that I make about those places also linked in the article so you can uh, you can really go in depth and read uh, and really uh, educate yourself uh, about the things that uh, you want to educate maybe i will also add uh, some information from different various books about the history of the places about if something is some villager or some person is telling me then i can record their voice or maybe i can play that voice somewhere in the website or i can transcribe their voice and add it to the website so you really get a, so to i will kind of wanna i i really wish to give you the most authentic uh, information and i guess i should say review or uh, i guess it's just kind of i think that uh, when you go back when you come to Kriti and you ha you spend your time here and the things that you plan to do i want to help you with that and then when you return home i want you to leave with a good memory with a good product with with with, with a bunch of goodness uh, with you 
to return and maybe that will be the reason that you come back again so i just want to help you to i just want to help you yeah and what uh, what i'm gonna get uh, is that there are some stories that I noticed that I cannot openly talk in YouTube about it because there is demonetization, there is restriction, then there is a lot of things you cannot really openly talk in YouTube. So there are some stuff that which is very personalized to so some people can understand, but uh, a bigger audience cannot relate to that because they are here for the video, exactly not for what I'm right now saying. They are here to just see I use Nikolaus and uh, create their own uh, idea but i know there are uh, some of you that they really care about uh, the details and they are interested in in uh, in people's life and then their experiences and that's who we are or that makes us social so yeah let me know what are your thoughts what are your suggestions if you have any tips tricks share it with me uh, if 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 we have enough uh, positives then i will kind of begin to work on it this shop is one of the kindest and fairest shop in Ayus Nikolaus. If you are if you are coming ever to Ayus Nikolaus and you are staying in the area, you should probably be getting your uh, groceries groceries from here. She's a very nice, very kind lady. Uh, the prices are very affordable, and uh, they are really really kind people. And I can tell you that. Well, the details possibly one day I will share in the website. <laughs> Some colorful stuff <laughs> as well. <laughs> yeah, you may wanna, you know, color match everything in on, for an occasion. If you remember, I was here and I took this way, which you see in my background, and I went up and then I went around the square and I came down. And now I'm gonna cross the zebra, uh, hoping not get hit by a car. And the man is trying to drive <laughs> over. But anyways, you know life, sometimes uh, people are not in the relaxed mood. So now we will be walking uh, like this is kind of the sea front side of Ayus Nikolaus and behind this area there are some really nice coffee shops and taverns which I want to share with you as well. I can see too many buses over there uh, at the port and I see too many people walking toward the uh, buses, uh, the buses which are at the port. So it, it, it seems to me like they are kind of uh, living in one of the resorts in the area and they have been brought uh, by the buses to Ayos Nikolaus to hang out and then now they are uh, returning back to the place they are supposed to be <laughs> yeah uh, so and also I should mention like this is the area where uh, you can buy tickets for, uh, for for the boat to go to Spinalonga. Uh, I have done it, uh, I guess, twice uh, from the Ilunda 
but it will be nice to do it from a US Nikolaus because you will have a little bit uh, more of a ride until getting uh, to Spinalonga and I guess the boat is not taking you from within the Spinalonga it's gonna be taking you from outside the edge of um, the island that's where you will get to see the beach of uh, Kulukita beach and also there is a small island and th that small island also has uh, I guess one or one beach one connected round beach so which is a nice thing maybe then the other day you get inspired and then you will uh, drive to Kulukita beach or hike to Kulukita beach and swim to that uh, little island so yeah and here we have really chic cafe bar Bistro, I don't know what that is. All right, so if you would walk uh, this uh, path, then you will uh, get here. I didn't capture uh, all of this because it is nothing, just some flags and uh, the sea. So here it is uh, starting the like the area where the, the taverns and the coffee shops are and here we have this famous uh, structure made of uh, glass and here we have uh, also information about uh, Agios Nikolaos you can find yourself where you are and uh, follow uh, the path but for me this area is very interesting it's a very beautiful beach over there and I also would not mind in staying in one of these uh, hotels because they look uh, pretty decent to me. I prefer like even uh, a bit higher floor in case if you are able to do so or if they have an elevator then you, you will uh, get to hear less noise. And come on, look at this weather, look at these clouds, come on, not fair at all. <laughs> There are all days that I feel energetic, there are all days that I feel uh, absolutely in the mood. Uh, to do something and there are days that I'm in the mood to do something but I'm trying to put it together no matter how hard I try it's just not happening I'm kind of running out of words I'm uh, running out of ideas yeah the whole story and that makes me nothing but more of more a human and uh, whenever it is like that then you gotta remember like yeah he is today being human <laughs> instead of being Mr. Adventure. Yasu! Yeah. <laughs> 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 nice to see you! <laughs> Very glad you come again! I'm happy to be here oh, too! Oh, you remember me last year? Yes, I do remember! Swimming, swimming, yes, cross! Yes. Uh, yeah. You have a nice dog! <laughs> <laughs> nice little dog, it's a lion! Ah, yeah! A little one! Yeah! Sure. Yes, yes! <laughs> Enjoy your beer, sir! Yeah, and have a good time! Because here is a great place! And Giorgio, the boss, Giorgio, yeah. very good boss. Okay. Yorgos. Yorgos is a good Giorgio. boss. Okay. King Yorgos. King Yorgos. <laughs> Enjoy your beer. Of
and here we have a fish taverna right by the sea very nice view very nice place and then if you didn't know about this place in Ayos Nikolaus now you know Hello, Hank. You are famous. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Oi, now you are too. Uh, <laughs> I saw you in uh, Matala. Ah, thank uh, you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank Thanks for sharing. Enjoy your stay. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Out of the all of places, I would absolutely love to sit here. Uh, yeah, in this table, on a, here in this table, and have this whole view of mountains and listen to the waves hitting the rocks and if it is not windy i probably will prefer a candle as well yeah to keep the mood elevated yeah and after that i would absolutely definitely a hundred person a million thousand person will take a walk here look grab her hand don't just go crazy at once be patient be slow be a gentleman okay softly slowly and gently grab her hand take her for a walk and when you find the right moment uh, initiate <laughs> whatever it was in the first place in your mind but dinner candle uh, gentle walk is absolutely a must okay <laughs> and then tomorrow you can go to one of the beaches yeah i will definitely uh, suggest there is a village it's called pachea amos pachea amos i will leave a link in the description they also have very good taverns and then you can take her for lunch there what else do you want me to tell you come on man links in the description these tips they were a billion yeah this can make your life and if you don't use them then yeah only i don't know just i don't know <laughs> pache amos beach is over there it's a very big beach it's a very uh uh, unadvertised, a very uh, authentic uh, village. Because of the way the village is uh, laid, there is a highway uh, passing through the village. Not too many supermarkets, not uh, like this mega uh, joint companies conquered anything. But if you would go to the seafront side of the place, there are some taverns and there is the beach is so big, the beach is so beautiful and uh, I guess you are going to like it. Take her for the lunch there, yeah. And it's not too far away from here, I guess 25 minutes walk or something. 25 minutes drive, yeah.
so in this area uh, you can see the people are uh, fixing the boats and you will get to see these uh, boats here uh, also a nice view you will see some uh, yachts as well that they are i don't know if repairing or coloring or whatever yeah so or doing the maintenance job yeah, you can take this walk and you can really have a good time And now if you would walk straight, we are going to end up back to the square which I showed you before. So I took a whole uh, round walk uh, around the block. It is more than a block, but I took a whole round uh, walk. I enjoyed also my walk. I also saw a very beautiful landscape. Also there are those events and coffee shop with very cool uh, people and uh, you know Yorgos is the king <laughs> yeah and now I ended up here so in this area we have uh, also like a, a Sovalaki shop which is called Al, Al Dente Meat Branch I have eaten here before uh, and uh, I am happy with the, what I get for the bag uh, for the bag is that correct I'm learning these things okay yeah and we have a mini market here as well so and and uh, here is a paid parking uh, if you are somebody who has the luxury to to pay then i absolutely uh, recommend you to park your car somewhere uh, where you also pay and it is much secure and there is uh, it's kind of nice to do things the way uh, that it can benefit uh, the society indirectly maybe not directly but it is kind of like uh, you are uh, kind of contributing to the the better of the society like by not uh, jamming the traffic by not parking somewhere to crash the car or also not creating problem for you as so this, here we have a parking area i don't think that i it's it is so necessary for me to insist about a parking place but it is me what to do yeah and here we have uh, a beach it's uh, amos beach and they have they, it's really amos means uh, sand in uh, amo means uh, sand in greek language and this is the sand beach and i guess it is pretty sandy yeah they are now putting the umbrellas over there uh, and they will be soon putting out uh, the sun bits as well and right in front of the beach you have this cafeteria and uh, also some taverns a little bit uh, further from here few steps uh, in front of me uh, yeah it's also not a bad uh, option to choose if you remember my video from the which one it was like uh a moody no there is a beach i have made a video i don't remember the name and you can also the path from that beach also comes here and if you would want to walk the whole path go to that beach and return that's also an option i guess i would suggest that if i was somebody who was staying here in ajos nikolaus i will grab my bag put some snacks there and also explain the whole idea to my girlfriend and then we would walk to that beach we will spend a day and then we will uh, come here uh, that could be like a change you will get to see some beautiful stuff uh, on your way and meanwhile i will also leave that video uh, in the description so you can watch and see and decide for yourself if you want to walk there or not The temperature is 21 uh, degrees Celsius. 
As you can see, it's written over there. And the taverna name is Basilico, Cretan Cuisine, and Pizza and Pasta, and Kalos uh, Orisate, welcome. Yeah, fresh fish. <laughs> it's just so much fun to look at these things <laughs> and read them, yeah. Take away as well. Yeah, so this is kind of the... Uh, Northeastern uh, end of Agios Nicolaos, oh, where these taverns are. Yes, that's. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm making a YouTube video. That's over Cabo. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Alitia. Yeah, please. Yeah, YouTube. <laughs> oh, nice to meet you, my Nice to meet you. I have channel in YouTube. Really good. Yes, for be life. Yeah, what What do you upload? About what? About uh, from bees. Ah, bees. Yes. Very I good, have, very good. I have bees. Ah, okay. Come to Creta and enjoy your food and the bees. <laughs> it's perfect and very nice uh, view and place yeah. in here in Marina Inagios Nicolos. I hope to see you here. Yeah. So, yeah. nice and to meet you. I will also you. link uh, your channel in the description so they can find you. And if they want uh, honey, do you have biological honey? Biological? Yes. Yeah, yes. Organic, biological, so good. Yes, okay, perfect. Cool. For theme, for eucalyptus, for pine tree, yeah. from, um, from flowers. It's okay. perfect. Okay, then I will uh, connect your. Uh, the, uh, yeah, I will leave a link of your channel in the description so you can see and you can meet Adonis in person and see how he's growing the bee. And also, in case if you have any orders for uh, honey, you can uh, maybe get in contact. Do you have yes, a, uh, I have a mail. Uh, okay, cool. Is it in your channel connected? Yes. Okay, cool. So, uh, if you want anything, I know can you can in the channel. Can yeah. <laughs> so she can uh, subscribe. Write also a comment. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Nice Anony to meet you, sir. <laughs> yes. I hope to enjoy your holiday. Yeah. I, I, I do. I do enjoy. I, Bye. I really. By the way, I live in Heraklion. <laughs> ah! And yeah. you come in here from Heraklion? Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, it's Perfect. still a holiday. <laughs> Small holiday. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Yeah, so this is where uh, the taverns uh, ends, but I can see over four over there like a uh, maybe some uh, umbrellas well also there is also a small an, another small beach it possibly can be uh, also like a club cafe or some sort of uh, fun place that you can explore you can explore by yourself okay what is left i guess yeah let's call it a wrap yeah and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. It was not like very well rounded. I, 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 I accept that, but uh, you know, whatever comes, comes. Uh, yeah, share your thoughts, recommendations in the comment section. And I will also leave uh, a link to the Adonis uh, channel in the description. So you can also uh, see him, what he is doing and what he is up to. Uh, he seems like a cool person, cool guy. It will be nice to see uh, how he is doing this whole honey and beating. And then there you go. You have uh, yourself a solid person who can send you honey anywhere in the world. Yeah. And uh, share your thoughts, recommendations and consider subscribing if you are already bored. <laughs> Other than that, until the next time, peace.